certainly get the Halloween vibe. Maybe they could put some orange in there or something, right? Like some extra cheese. So we have a black and orange burger and uh, maybe serve it with a little plastic ghost. We did the Burger King challenge a few days last week because we'd seen on the internet with the new Halloween burger which has a black bun that it has some interesting results after you've eaten it. So we thought we would give it a shot. It's basically a Whopper with a black bun. Uh, they say there's A1 sauce in it. I uh, didn't have anything special put on it, just a normal Whopper with the black bun. Burger was tasty. I, I really didn't taste any too much of the A1 sauce, really. Um, it's supposed to be infused in the bun. I didn't, I didn't taste too much of it. Personally, I didn't taste it anywhere. Um, I also heard there was no ketchup and mayonnaise, which would be kind of weird, but there was on ours. And to me, it tasted like a regular Whopper, which I love Burger King and Whopper sandwiches. So it didn't gross me out, you know, even though it was black and some people were looking at us going, what the heck are you doing? Because normally if the, the bun's black, it's been sitting in its casing for quite a while. Uh, our challenge was to figure out whether or not we had the end results <laughs> of eating this particular burger with the black bun. A little bit later on that day, started to happen. So I was waiting contently, see, for any of the internet type of rumblings to happen in my tummy. I'll be honest with you, I was very skeptical and it took less than 12 hours. My overall experience was uh, satisfactory, quite honestly, and things kind of wound up Sort of like that. Mine was kind of uh, neon, if you will. No, I didn't light it up. I lit it up, but I mean, uh, I'll end my lament with this. The scary thing for me was not visiting the uh, Golden Throne once. <laughs> not twice, <laughs> but three times. And I'm thinking, when is this going to end?